am an aerospace physiology U2 launch and recovery technician. Tube food is basically normal food that has been pureed down to tube form so it can fit through the tube. Um, here we have caffeinated chocolate pudding. So during the duration of the flight, anywhere from 10 to 12 hours, um, gives them a little kick while they're up in the aircraft. Um, pilots, what they would normally do is the tube food would already be assembled. It just will not be tightened down all the way. So while they're up in altitude, they'll go ahead and tighten this down. There's a little feeding port here. They'll go ahead and insert this into the feeding port. And kind of like a tube of toothpaste, you would start from the bottom and roll up. Standard tube food, um, it's kind of the normal calories you would get. Um, usually they want to do a high protein diet. Pilots want to watch what they eat um, prior to a flight because they are not allowed to defecate in the suit. Um, depending on the duration of the flight, um, they can fly anywhere from upwards of 12 hours. So depending on each pilot, each pilot is different. They will bring one tube food per hour or they'll have a dessert in there. Um, it just depends on the pilot preference mostly. With some of the pilots that have been in here the longest, they're, you know, they pretty much eat the same thing before a flight and probably a couple hours before the flight. Um, newer pilots, they kind of do like a kind of a test basis on what their stomach can handle while they're up in altitude. Um, the most popular foods are one is the caffeinated chocolate pudding and then the chicken a la king is another popular entree that we have. So they actually got a chef to actually come in and create these and they're doing test runs with the pilots to see which ones they like the best and then they'll start putting those in production.